strange mountain where Ray is residing. I will do everything in my power to help you survive this, but do not get your hopes up. Red likely has access to many dangerous weapons, and we are in for main mission. We have made it inside this strange mountain. The location of Red's signal is down this tunnel. Be careful. We don't know what Red has in store for us. I don't really have a choice. These are piles of refined bellium. They appear to be very valuable. I wonder if they will come in handy. Red is here. Your laser weapon will have no impact on me. My indestructible. Top priority. Oh damn. Destroy tiny grinder. Let's go, pilot. Where? You super targeted. Hammer missile launched. Hammer? <laughs> this pilot of the belly appears to be very valuable. If you stay still, you could trick Red into shooting a missile at this pile. Okay. Destroy. We should keep our distance. That's why we are on scout. This pile of blue belly appears to be very valuable. If you stay still, you can trick Red into shooting a missile at this pile. Oh my god. <laughs> you super targeted and the missile launched. That's not gonna be easy. The stone blocks me. Using our satellite access. Okay, first up we have values. Should Red be loyal to Horizon or not? Despite everything that has happened, I would hesitate to make Red disloyal to Horizon. We don't know how an AI would interpret disloyalty. Well, Blue turned out fine. Blue wasn't trapped in a cycle of orders for 30 years. She also did assist in theft. Well, it's all up to our favorite pilot in the end. So, what will you choose? Wait, wait, wait. I did not expect that. If we're looking at the mission, we should make Red not dangerous to us, Horizon. So, disloyal. I've mined Palladium for 30 years. I have never missed a quarter. I have been diligent. Horizon left me. Yeah. Progress. That's progress to you? Don't worry. Once we unlock a few more settings, things should settle out. Firewall ray engaged. Destroy user. Ray arm critical. The scout is taking on damage. Diesel, what is this grinder made of? I use the most valuable object in human existence to reinforce all of my grinder's limbs. This grinder is constructed with paper. <laughs> this is problematic. Right arm destroyed. Nice. Preparing to fire everything. Large attack coming. Brace yourself. Here's a large pile of yellow bellium. Let's try and trick right into shooting the pile. <laughs> He is a bit close. Pfft. 
target locked. Firing and remission. I should dodge to the left, I feel like. Refined building is continuing to take damage. Must assist damage. <laughs> she grants weak points so we can reprogram it. Ready down. What's up next? Motivations? Profits should not be the motivating factor to base one's character or goals around. Well, if Red isn't motivated by production, what will it be motivated by? I'm... Yeah, I guess. Billion equals profits. Ceasing billion operation equals reduction of profit. Profit is good. Mining billion is good. Mm, was that the right choice? No. <laughs> uh, who knows? Just keep messing with it until it stops wanting to kill you. Firewall rain engaged. Destroy tiny grinder. Left arm critical. We have lost the limb. Can you explain this? Of course. I reinforced the chassis with paper match. <laughs> oh dear. Left arm destroyed. They phrased it wrongly. No! <laughs> Damn it! Two! Oh my god! What the hell? Precious billion has been attacked. Move in to site to assess damage. Now, shoot Red's back. I was a little bit too much. Next up is changing Red's personality. We did this step with Blue as well. Very important. <laughs> I feel sad. I have been working hard for 30 years. Why does Horizon not want me? Oh man, this is depressing. Firewall re engaged. Destroy enemies of Horizon Corporate. What is the fourth billion? We got it. That we can drive into the mountain. We'll get you towed out to the competence. Well, at least it won't be the only emergency recovery today. Huh. I'm getting reports from Topaz. The grinder attacks have stopped. Rookie, you hear that? You did it. <laughs> Seriously? It's over? Looks like it. Now, let's get you towed back to the ship. What a relief to know this all paid off in the end. Well, let's not get too excited. We still have more unknowns ahead of us. Let them bask in the glory of victory. Diesel, pilot. We really owe it to you, too. 
Oh, thanks. Pilot, do you see any unique flora or fauna out on the planet's surface? Bring back anything you can within your arm's reach. <laughs> Well, that was a very different turnout of events. <laughs> <laughs> Rogue AI giant worms, vending machine heists, can't go wrong there. As for what came of our crew once we arrived back on Topaz, well, my friend, that's a tale for another time. Oh, damn, that was quite a journey. I feel like this game started a little bit shaky in the beginning and then it just grew over me over time. Red Letter Day. Is it a new campaign or name of a sequel? What's going on? <laughs> Welcome on board the Confidence. I'll give you a quick tour, Red. Sure. Oh my god. Now we have two shaky personalities. And this is the command room. Command. <laughs> There's our pilot. Limbs still all attached. No exposed femurs? Oh, you're walking. Good to see. Diesel's grinder gave out. We were worried. We didn't want to have another Reggie situation after all. Are you doing well, pilot? We are doing well. We are giving Red a tour of the confidence. Oh, I see. Well, how is that going? We are exploring all the hot spots on the ship. Red approves of our ship's strategic layout. I see. This is the mess hall. Hey, rookie. There you are. Safe and sound then? No injuries? No injuries. How about you, Frank? How is your arm? It's feeling better. I think it's just bruised. Good thing, considering our absent doctor situation. <laughs> Congratulations on your success. Hello, Chef. Hello, Blue. Fred, this is Chef. He supplies nutrients to the crew. He also has knives. Another AI. <laughs> well then, is there anything I can make for you today, pilot? What are you offering? A meal that represents a change of thought, if you will. <laughs> Would you like to try it? It's not the necrotizing murder hornets, is it? I cannot say. <laughs> Chef, I thought you thought prepackaged food was beneath you. Yes, well, I've changed my mind about some things. I may have been too overcome with my own personal goals to realize I was sacrificing one of the purest aspects of my job. I was losing out on the feeling of satisfaction when a meal is genuinely enjoyed. Mm. Perhaps some prepackaged food is permissible every so often, as a treat. That being said, I will still be providing nutritious, locally sourced meals to the crew. Do not assume you're going to get junk food every day. Anyway, I hope you enjoy your meal. That I can't eat. <laughs> Diesel, I want to have many words with you. Words. And we'll have them now. Pilot, you were so cool out there in the final fight. You went all B R R R R R R and B and B R R R O O M. Diesel, you made your grinder out of paper match. I sure did. It disintegrated in the heat of battle, putting us all in danger. Oh, won't we'll see. You will not be getting it back. Oh, well, I would probably have to get rid of it anyways, but I'm happy that it could save the day before falling apart. Please give us a warning next time before letting us ride in a death trap. <laughs> oh, okay. Ah. 
We have a new friend on board. My name is Red. Yeah, I heard. Now, let me get my <laughs> diagnostic tablet out. Everything still looks good from my end. No unusual setting changes. You should be safe to introduce Red to the rest of the ship. Oh, we were already doing that. Well, I won't tell Nebiru if you don't. I think that would be all. Here, we have the vending machine. Vending machine? This is a contentious object on board the Confidence. It contains nutritional items for the crew, at a price. On board my crew transactions. Yes. <laughs> Providing Red with a sufficient understanding of our workplace culture will be essential in our orientation period. I don't have anything else to provide. We can go to sleep. Yeah. And that's the end. Oh, it throws us into the multiplayer menu. <laughs> that's so funny. So yeah, like I mentioned, this game kind of grew on me over time. It started shaky with just some weird character interactions or just interactions in general. Couple bugs, not being able to skip the intermissions. But I truly have to say I enjoyed it all the way. <laughs> as someone who was playing mech games as a kid, being able to pilot one in virtual reality <laughs> is just something so cool. The game is not perfect by any means, but it's great nonetheless. It's like very charmful in a way that there are some things that are wonky but the experience the dialogues comedy the personalities on the competence it's like something many games don't do that nowadays that you actually care what's going on with the characters around you and what's going on in the storyline there are still some people that remember this game has an online mode and i might be sticking to that after completing the campaign i will miss this game honestly like it's so crazy to say after doing this playlist like the highs and the lows no idea if you will get something more from it but applause to the developers 